Alright guys, and we're back for another episode of Deja Vu. You see a mugger in your way. He wants all of your money. He probably wants you to give it to him. I wouldn't doubt it. You know what? Here. You want it so damn bad. Use it on this guy. Bullshit, the gun wasn't even fucking loaded. You shot me with it like three goddamn times. So now might not be the best time to brush up on current. Whoa! Joey's hitman has been waiting for you. I got the word that he was waiting in your office. I guess and that's the dead guy. Let's talk to this dude. Uh, 50 cents is a small price to pay for your life, man. <clears throat> okay, now why would you know that? Standing on the street in front of Pete's All Night Gun Place. Okay. What's in the wastebasket? Nothing. I've got a feeling I don't need any ammo. This is Peora Street. The cab is waiting. Okay. Open the door. Pop in. Okay, hold on. <clears throat> so that'll just take me back to... Peoria will just take me back to, I believe, the bar that I just left. Sherman, though. Sherman seems like it's an address that I need to go to. You... No, 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 no. Speak. Sherman. Damn it, what do I have to do? Use? Use Sherman. Speak. Sherman. You owe me 75 cents. <coughs> Damn, this is a cheap cab. I like this guy. Use... Coins... Here. Cool. I like this guy. He's alright. You're on a street. It's really quiet around here. Open the door. Go in. You're in the lobby of the office building. There's a hallway in front and a staircase to your left. We'll go through the hallway. Dr. Brody. Wait. <coughs> One of the keys goes to this, I bet you. This key won't fit. Why did I assume otherwise? I mean, it's only a key. Stairs. Okay, go up the stairs. You're standing in front of the eyes, in front of an office. The words Ace Harding, Private Eye, are on the door. You see someone's shadow through the glass. You feel very dazed. You had better do something about it. Your memory loss is making you feel wary. You have to do something, but you don't know what to do. Okay, 
dude already told me that this guy was a very, 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 very bad person. And just for that, I'm going to save right here. Bonk. Cool. Okay. Thank you, Bob. Use the gun on the face. Watch it be nobody. You've shot whatever was standing inside the office. The door won't open. <coughs> God, I'm really sorry about the cops, guys. Key three. You can't do that. Here. No, key one, because that's what was in the wallet. Well, is it key one? Key three? This key won't fit. The key two is to the car. I'm confused. Hit the window. Wham, your hand is numb from the impact. Open the fucking door. You know what? Fuck you. You know what I'm gonna do? Use. The gun on the lock. Boom. Why did you bother with fuck you? That makes a lot of fucking sense. What do you mean why did I bother wasting bullets? You asshole. Okay, the key won't fit, key two, although I know it's probably not going to work. This key won't fit. Really? I never would have guessed. It's a fucking car key. Of course it won't fit. <clears throat> this key won't fit. I don't think I have any more keys, dude. I really don't. Uh. I don't know what to do. I think I missed something. No. I can't move myself. Okay, I'm in the lobby of a building. Cool. You're on the street. It's really quiet around here, and you just blew someone's brains out. <clears throat> no. We're on a street. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. I need to check the code again. It's all to have another fucking key in there. Coats. No. Okay. So I'm not a complete idiot. Um, examine the capsules. What's inside of these? <coughs> You have a hunch that there's a connection between you and the capsules. Okay. I don't understand. Open the door. Hit the door, knock on it. Speak to the door. Speak to it, my dear friend. <coughs> okay, wait. I already know I don't know shit. Okay, I know I'm forgetful person. Fuck. Speak. Who are you speaking to? Okay, guys. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and pause this here and continue in a second, so there's going to be a brief lapse. Okay, we're back. And... Examine. I've shot whatever was standing inside the office. Are you kidding me? Examine self. You're doing a great job. Keep trying, really. I'm going to talk to myself. 
Okay. <clears throat> Talking to yourself might be fun, but it isn't very helpful. Oh my god. Alright, I guess we need to go back. Yeah, no, there's some stuff here. Let's go. I probably ain't got not a lot of money to work with this, so let's <coughs> hop in the cab. Let's talk to this guy. Where do you want to go? I want to go to West End. You owe me 75 cents. Oh, hell yeah. Alright. That's the same as before. I'm cool with that. I'm still cool with that. Yay. One, two, three. Thanks a lot. Yada, 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 yada. Cool. Ooh. Open the door and walks in like I own this fucking place. Ooh. It appears to be a slot for a card. Hey. We'll open the wallet. Use the card. You can't use it. God damn it, you're inside of something I took. Why can't I use you? Fuck you, man. <coughs> okay, move the notes. No card. Card. Use card on that. Yeah, okay. So I need to use the card again. Alright. So apparently I just blew this dude's brains out long before I needed to. Cool. The elevator's door slides shut and begins moving. You have no choice but to go along for the ride. The elevator stops and the door swooshes open. You're in a penthouse. You instantly feel that the owner of this place is well off. It's a big, round, well-polished mirror. Okay, it's a fireplace, but it can only be a decoration. Ooh, it's a leather covered sofa. Oh, what's in the book? It's a magazine, but you really have no time to read. There's gotta be something here. Let's take the pain. You can't take it. Let's take the mirror. <coughs> Let's hit the pain. Let's hit the mirror. Let's open the pain. Damn it, there's gotta be something here. Okay. It's a magazine, but you really have no time to read it. It's a photograph of a very stout looking brunette. On the back, you find an address 520S Kedzie in Chicago. Okay, so that's where I need to go next. Fireplace, it's gonna be decoration. One could admire the quality of this chair for hours on end. Amazing. What's with this? <coughs> the chandelier matches the room nicely. Very nice place. You're inside the elevator. Choose the door. So we have a new address that we can go to. Elevator stops and the door slides open. Okay. Let's move down. Apparently I can't really go anywhere else. Alright, let's talk to this guy. The driver said bluntly, Hey mister, where you wanna go? I wanna go to Kenzie, because that's a new place. Here you are, you owe me 75 cents. Sure thing, good sir. Hold on a moment. Money. Hey, huh? The driver begins counting because counting is a hard thing to do for a fare. 
One, two, three quarters. Thanks a lot, pal. I kind of feel bad that he has to count in order to understand what a quarter is. It's a bungalow. Ooh. Can't be moved if it's not open. Open. The door won't open. It must be locked. Locked. Okay. Use the key three. Maybe. This key won't fit. Well, fuck me running. Key one. This key won't fit. Wait. No, 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 no. Of course the door won't open. That's all I was going for. What do you think you're doing? Examine. It's a bungalow. Okay. Take the fucking rug, dude. What the hell am I doing? I'm starting to feel real stupid here. Use key two on this. The key won't fit. Fuck me. Dude, I don't even know what I'm doing right now. Oh my god. It's a bungalow. It's a bungalow. Bungalow. You're in the back seat of a cab. Okay, cool. So, I'm going to... Go back where the fuck I came from. Because I'm about positive I missed something. I just don't know what the hell it is. West End. You owe me 75 cents. Okay. Use... Hey, where's my money? Okay, so I need to get the fuck out of this car. Awesome, I took the wrong path. Oh, actually, hey. No. I have no idea what I'm doing. You wasted your money. Speak. Okay, where do you want to go? Take me to Sherman, I guess. quiet around here. God! Damn it! Really? Go. Go left. Left. Addresses. Okay, I'm trying not to fucking miss this. Piora. That's where he was in the first place. Fuck. God, I'm a dumbass. Talk to him. Hey, where do you want to go? Piora. Here you are, 75 cents. Use... Uh, give him the man the three fucking quarters. You can't use the pay here booth. You suck at pay here booths. Alright guys, since I pretty much wasted your time on this one, I'm going to keep going. So, if you will, hold on for one second. Okay, and we're back. Let's continue moving left down this way then. It's Peora Street. What the hell is this? Oh, it's a yellow cab. Speak to the yellow cab. I'm speaking to a yellow cab. What do you think I'm doing? I'm doing the only thing I know. The cabbie looks like a nice guy. Sweet. Where do you want to go, mister? I want to go to PR. Mister, don't act stupid. This is where you want to go. Oh, thank you then. 
You're a nice cabby. You probably charge more too. Because of the politeness. <coughs> There's a drunk crossing the street. You're on the street in front of a newsstand. Take one. I'm gonna talk to him. Okay, so you need a quarter. Okay, I'll take the newspaper. Oh, shit! Okay! Apparently, bitch knows who I am. Okay. Alright. Well, I know what my first objective is. Okay. The door. Oh my God! I forgot. I. I. Okay, guys. Just to fill you in, the reason why small details are changed is because the game decided to be an asshole and not save for me after the last what the last episode ended, and it just closed out because of some glitch. When it closed out, I had to go through and redo a lot of the stuff. So. I've got to actually do a couple of different things, but I don't think I missed anything from my past episodes. At least I hope not. I feel like a real fucking moron. Okay, use key three, because that's the one that opened this bar. Okay, unlocks the front door. I walked in. Cool. Let's walk back out. Okay, so apparently there was a bitch over here. It can't be moved if it's not open. Alright, let's open this shit. What? No, don't open the manhole, you fucking idiot. Oh my god, I bet you I know what it is. Okay, let's feel bad again. Doghouse Riley. You don't fuck with Doghouse Riley, yo. So you look through the window, you see nothing unusual. Yeah, yeah, I get it. There's a dead guy there. Standing on the third floor fire escape, you have a breathtaking view of the valley below. You guys have probably already seen this. <clears throat> but I'm an idiot who doesn't know how to check everything the first time, so you have to excuse me a bit. I'm inside the elevator. Okay. I'm already on the fourth floor, I remember this. The third floor just takes me back to the guy with the dead body. Second floor takes me to the casino. Where's the first? No, the first floor takes me to the manholes. Maybe, maybe there's an area that I missed in the manholes. Oh god, don't do this. There we go. Let's move down the manhole. Let's go further down the rabbit hole. Okay, so I can do that right there, and then I can go backwards. Ooh! I'm in the deepest part of the sewer. Move. There must, there's gotta be nothing in that sewer right now. Let's go here. I'm pretty sure I took that exit before. Keep going right. Right. Okay, so apparently it's just gonna bounce me this way every time. Go right. Go up. Yeah, I never actually did this. Open. Bonk. Yeah. Bonk. 
and the rooms are connected. What's this look for? Uh, it's nothing. Damn it. You know what? <coughs> Oh my god. Hold on. Move. Use the capsules. And the seltzer. Use the seltzer. On myself. Whoa, I still have seltzer. Cool. I'm probably about to die. Yay! Nothing happens. The capsule is empty. Oh, you sneaky bastard. Oh my god, I really got this and never actually read it. The Japanese bomb Pearl Harbor. Oh god, so this is set right before World War II. That's crazy. Okay. So I've already got this. <coughs> oh my god, I probably didn't look, look all the way through the car. I feel like a dipshit now. Let's examine it. It's the ignition. Just waiting for someone to grab it up. Take the key. Take the fucking key. I know how to take the goddamn key. Oh my god. The steering wheel has a last cover on it. There doesn't seem to be anything unusual. It's the ignition. This is the brake pedal. What's this one? That's a clutch. Okay. Maybe there's... Okay, there's supposed to be a dead body in the trunk that I never actually looked at. So I need to open the trunk. The door won't open. It must be locked. Well, let's see. Considering that I know of nothing else that could possibly open this fucking thing. Let's try key tip. This key won't fit. Fuck you. This key won't fit. Fuck you. God damn it. You know what? Fuck this. I'm gonna hit it and hit it and hit it again. I'm gonna even hit this. Use. I, why can't I you do this here? Pencil. I will use the pencil to unlock this. You can't do that here. Fuck you. Alright guys, I'm seriously trying. Um if you know what I need to do, let me know in the comments. Um, rate, subscribe, and if you want to see more, um, message me if you want me to play a different game. I'm more than willing to um, play a game if you guys recommend it to me. Um, and I guess I'll see you in the next episode.